Yo, what up, it's your boy Genic One Hundred Swap Master General here, coming back at you, at you with part eighteen of Yakuza Five, where we're still on a date with Riku Chan. Uh, last time, I, we just did cabaret clubu things, got her affection up, and invited her out on a date. She is now hungry, and we know she hates ramen. Take her to Hanamadori since it's right there. As we run away fiercely from our date. I didn't even see him. Welcome, this way please. Are you ready to order? I could go for the Hana course. Looks like Riku wants the Hana course. Alright, time to dig in. You know, Kiryu-san, I could bet, or I bet you could eat a horse, huh? Well, my appetite's not as big as when I was younger, but the food here in Hakata is really good, so I've been checking out as many restaurants as I can. Wow, men can be such foodies, checking out new hot spots all the time, eh? You don't want to pick a lousy restaurant when you invite a lady out to dinner, after all. Yeah, I'm happy to let the guys take me out for a nice meal, but I'm worried if I keep going out, I'll get fat, you know? Okay to put on some weight. Guys like it when girls look healthy instead of scrawny. No way, Buster. Once you pack on the pounds, they're impossible to drop. I just make sure to watch what I eat because it's way easier than trying to diet lately. Does that mean you're holding back now? <laughs> yeah, I'm actually pretty hungry, but I'll get by. You really don't need to hold back. If you're hungry, just eat. It's fine. I don't know how the fuck that was the right decision, but I did it. Ooh, I'm stuffed. Thank you. Well, I, I don't have the money to keep going to the cabaret club, Ooh, so this might be it. Until I get money. So. That was delish. Thanks for treating me. Oh boy, I'm beat. Something the matter? Oh, okay. Come by the comic head soon, okay? I don't think there's a massage parlor or anything. I don't think we could have taken her home. Either way, I'm out of money, so... Hope you enjoyed it. <laughs> Found you. Why are you looking for me? Why does everybody want to fight the fourth chair? Huh? Mika me, you idiot! But you said you couldn't move, God!
still drunk. But da 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 There's no need for this extracurricular. Start the fight. Oh, Sato, you you ain't got nothing on the real Sato. Oh, actually, that was Saito. Yeah, you ain't you ain't. Okay, I'll be waiting for you. It's pretty packed today, so you can come. Uh, so come as early as you can. Don't know why she's just not responding to that, but hey. Hopefully, it now does not look like I was lying to her when I don't go. Why are you calling me a moron? It's over here, the kid that was studying? Oh. Okay. Let's continue the story. But should I go to bed? Yeah, I should get some rest. I'm exhausted. Chapter 3 The plot unfolds. Oh, oh boy. Morning Glory. Early summer, 2011, Okinawa. Okay. You're really going, huh? Uh, yeah. But why? I already said I'm staying here with you. You'll be in high school next year. Taichi and Koji will graduate junior high the year after that. You don't need me watching over you anymore. And don't assume I'm doing this for your sake. I'm just tired of all this babysitting. Uso. Liar! I can see it in your face! Uso Believe it. This is the best thing for me. You're going into show business has nothing to do with it. I know there's more uh, to it than that. You're lying through your teeth and I know it, Uncle Kaz. It's the buddy, isn't it? Park san said she'd make sure we were taken care of. But I only, only if you leave, right? Sorry, I know you're lying, only lying for our sake. That doesn't mean I don't deserve the truth.
Taichi is saying he wants to skip high school and just get a job. Not only Taichi, Ayako and Koji too. Not even Shiro is talking about finding work. They sacrifice their futures to help you protect it. You and protect one of the boy. They say they can all hold things together until you're ready to come home. They do that for me? Of course. You're their ray of hope. If you came back a star, nothing would make them happier. I'm sure of it. Guys, we but they're too young to be throwing their lives away. We might be strapped for cash, but that's no reason to squander your chances. I won't let them do it. Still, they want you here with us more than anything. And I agree. Thank you, Haruka. But the timing's right. Always oh, knew we'd have uh, to go our separate ways someday. So I'm going. Because I love you and everyone else at Morning Glory. At Morning Glory. Uncle Cass. Interesting. Head for Nagasu Taxi. Oh, there's no new question marks. That sucks. So, the whole reason we're here is to send money to Morning Glory to keep it afloat while Haruka tries to become a famous idol. We're running away. That's why we keep sending money to Morning Glory. Oh, there are. Wait, what's here? Oh, what's here? There's a sub story. We must ignore all main story. Do it. Sixteen ounces down. Hello, is anyone home? I just thought I'd come by to greet my new neighbor. Someone move next door. Oh, hello there. I'm with the Nagasu Times, and I'd like to offer you a great deal on a newspaper subscription. What? I thought you were here because you moved in. No, oh, you just moved in, right? So I came to welcome you to the neighborhood. I've been living here six months. <laughs> oh, you have? Huh, I didn't know that. You must be a new resident. In any case, I'd be more than happy to get you signed up for with our paper. How about I give you a free trial for the first month? Cancellation fees may still apply. So you're actually selling newspapers, and you use that moving in line to get people to open the door. Hey, don't make it sound like I'm a criminal. I did say hi, didn't I? Now, all I need is your signature, and you'll be waking up to that fresh newspaper smell in no time. Okay, you sold me, I'll sign up. <laughs> oh, you will? That's great. Let's make it a six-month subscription, shall we? What? I thought you said I could try it out for a month. Well, you might as well go uh, with at least six months paid. It save you the trouble of renewing, plus you get a better deal that way. Oh, how about I throw in some detergent as well? Would that sweeten the deal? Nothing like waking up to a pile of clean clothes in the morning paper, am I right? No, oh, I changed my mind. Huh? You can't just change your mind like that. Are you, aren't you a man of your word? You're the one who said a month to begin with. How about you keep your word as well? Uh, Don't you start quibbling with me. You've got no right to criticize. You better watch how you talk to people. Get out of here. Don't show your uh, face again. 
Hey, what's with the gold shoulder? I try to be nice and this is what I get in return. You think I'm gonna turn around and leave like that? You're the one sticking around when you're not welcome. I told you to get out. You better watch your mouth, asshole. I don't take any bullshit from a guy that's like you. Apologize to me right now. Do it. Okay, I've had enough of this. Huh? What are you gonna do? You don't think I can take your ass out? That's it. I'm through dicking around. Step outside and we'll sell this the hard way. <laughs> I wonder what you have in mind. I mean, I'm gonna cut the sales pitch and uh, give your face a tune-up. You're dead, me dead as meat now. Okay. Whatever you say. Okay, okay, my bad. Give me a break just this once. I promise not to bother you ever again. Never ever. I bet you've caught, uh, you caught tons of people out with these pushy, t uh, thoughtless sales tactics, haven't you? Oh no, sir, not at all. Well, you better drop the sales pitch altogether. If I hear you've been at it again, you'll have to answer to me. Got that? <laughs> yep, got it. Won't do it again. Honest to goodness. Here, why don't you take this? Hopefully it'll make up for my inexcusable and completely uncharacteristic behavior. Got high-grade platinum. Really, I'm sorry as can be, but I'll see myself out now. Have a nice day. Level up. You got 1,500 experience points. Oh, two things are upgraded all the way. Any more question marks? No. Let's go to Ebisu Pond, which is all the way down there, naturally. We'll make our big winding way down there. Interesting plot so far. What? What? Think that mask is gonna save you from the... All that mask is gonna do is make you drown in your own blood, Seto Kaiba. Wasn't even up. How do we go into that heat action? Oh, if you hit them while they're absolutely scared on the ground, it's an instant kill. Cut! Keep beating people up. If I edited, I would definitely just make a compilation. Right, I do have weapon skills. Didn't even go through his head. His head didn't go through it, I should say. Here we gotta go sell our high dollar stuff. What? I'm Shatid and I don't believe in gravity. I'm Shatid and I walk like this. I'm Shatid and I talk like this. Their weapon.
How we get in the street? drive my tax here on the entire city. There's so many fights. I just want to go to the pawn shop, please. Boy, these videos literally turn into nothing but me fighting. Yes, hey. We have money again.
Let's save it. Let's 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 save doing that. Let's see the story. If I regret it. Not very on this morning, you know what I mean? Not very talkative. Not very quippy. Even though I slept pretty good. I like the drop and the drop of water sound for it. Oh, you are near. Oh, Suzuki-san, just who I wanted to see. Good morning, Hirakawa-san. What can I do for you? We had an urgent pickup request to come in. Would you be able to take care of it? Sure, no problem. They're waiting at Nagasu Bridge. Drive safely. Hey, driver, I ordered a taxi. Hi. Right, thank you for waiting. I'm from Nagasu Taxi. Whatever, let's roll. Of course, where to? Hakata Station, on the double. Understood. What a mess. They sent us all the way to Fukuoka just uh, when we're about to hit Nagasugai for some fun. We gotta bounce. Think it was just an accident? Who knows? Hey, can you drive any faster? I'll see what I can do. You better. You must be in a hurry. Did something happen? One of our higher ups just died in an accident. We gotta go back to Osaka for the funeral. Is that the accident in Nagoya uh, that was in the paper? Yeah, and it wasn't us either. I hear Tojo Man bit the dust too. What? Did you just say the Tojo Clan too? Didn't you read the paper? There were two car crashes in Nagoya. Same day our man crashed his, cashed in his chips, the Tojo guy kicked the bucket on the same road. Seems too perfect to be a coincidence. If you ask me, it's high time the seventh chairman named his damn successor. Is that even possible at this point? I thought he had got terminal cancer. He ain't even taking visitors no more. There'll be trouble if the seventh chairman dies without naming anyone. You think some of us will be fighting for the throne? That'd be just what the other side wants, idiot. If there ain't a successor, they, the eighth chairman gets chosen by consensus for all the patriarchs in the end. The biggest faction wins out. 
You were either with Tashi family or Sakurai Enterprises. Oh, Sakurai Enterprises are the Takaichi family? Yeah, the Captain Watase is the vanguard of the Omi. But the biggest turf and most soldiers. Whereas our chief of HQ rules Sutton Bori, gaining influence through the massive tributes he pays. With Patriarch Takachi out of the way, the throne could go or the throne could go to either of them. This gentleman who was killed, was he a prominent figure as well? Huh? Our boss Takaichi? He was clan lieutenant, but not really one of the key players. For some reason, the seventh chairman had his back, though. But nobody messed with him. If Takaichi san had taken over as next chairman, I guess we could have avoided a lot of trouble. I see. But there's a lot of money changing hands to buy support from the Patriarchs, huh? It ain't simple as throwing money around. Taking the Omi leadership makes you top dog in the Yakuza world. If you want the spot, you're gonna have to do something to prove you deserve it. Yeah, like what? Let's see, killing the Tojo clan big shot might work. Ah, uh, like six chairman Dojima, or maybe his right hand man Majima. If you could pull that off, it'd be show real, uh, be a real show of strength for the Omi. That'd give you more than enough plot to take the throne. But it ain't like I was considering it though. Anyhow, all it is, uh, all it is to us soldiers more shit to worry about. Ain't that the truth? Hope they hurry up and get it over with soon. Hey, we there yet? Almost, just a little bit farther. Man, we got stuck with a real slow poke. Dojo clan. I go. I have nothing to do with them now. You always have something to do with them. Idiot, come on. Come on. Welcome back, Suzuki-san. You've been gone for quite a while. Well, I did have a long-distance passenger. Oh, lucky you. Then I assume you're finished for the day? We still have some calls to take care of, so let me know if you're interested. Will do. Do you actually have calls to take care of? Yeah, wait a lie to me. Way too lie to me. Hmm. I don't remember what voice I gave him. Hold on. We just want to ask a few questions. Yeah, right. I know what you Tojo snakes are up to. Yes, you're trying to pin the fact that your chairman went missing on us and use that as an excuse to steal our turf. You want to say that again, asshole? Aizawa, calm down. But Anaki. Aggravate, uh, aggravating with the Yamagatsu helps nobody. You'll have to excuse my partner here. He's a bit quick to fly off the handle. Anaki, you're just gonna let this guy walk after what he said? <laughs> I knew something like this would happen to us regular old Yamagasu boys. We're against this alliance from the get-go. What? Look, pal, I don't know how you run things up in Tokyo, but don't go thinking you're the star of the show here in Fukuoka. Yes, we understand that. But is there any way you can let this slide? I assure you, I'll discipline my friend here accordingly for the way he's treated you. Yeah. 
No way, you ain't getting off that easy. I'm gonna go report it right now. Hey, get back here. Stop it, Aizawa. You've done more than enough already. Now come, uh, now come. We need to keep looking for the champ. Fine. That guy really needs to learn how to control his temper. How'd you hear that? How'd you hear that? I'm impressed. Fuck, I'm a tired boy. So, we know they're still looking for the chairman. We know somebody from the Tojo died. We know somebody from the Omi died. Interesting. I want to use that move! Alright! Thank you for your money. Go away. How'd I get in the box? I mean, I'm happy I won, but how'd I get in the box? You got a dragon figure. Think Riku will like a dragon figure? Don't care, I won one. All I want to do is kill a few minutes. Well, uh, this is interesting enough, so we're sending money back to Morning Glory uh, because they're strapped for cash and needed all the help they can get, so we're out making money to send to them. While also allowing Haruka to go after her goal of being a 
top idol. That's interesting. Now I said, like I said, we have an Omi Man dead, a top ranking Omi Man dead, and a top ranking Tojo Man dead. Part 18, we did mostly story stuff. I really only went, I really already went over kind of that. Uh, next part, we might go back and see Riku. We might not, I don't know. Uh, either way, I hope you, if you enjoyed the video, please hit like. If you want to see more, like it, subscribe. And until next time, 